Hi, I'm Werner. I'm a developer at uh, Koitech. Today we'll go through some measurement setups using the ADC pins. In certain cases it's quite useful to get measurements from a subsystem in isolation together with the measurement of the total energy at the battery terminals. Uh, today we're performing this kind of measurement on a Cypress uh, Bluetooth low energy board. It's a remote control. Uh, the reference design makes it easy to measure the BLE chip current consumption isolated from the rest of the board peripherals. We can do that by removing the J1 jumper on the board and connecting a shunt resistor instead. I'm going to use a 4.4 ohm resistor which will result in a measurement range of just over plus minus 18 milliamps. Uh, this uh, resistor will then also be connected to the ADC plus and minus pins in the expansion connector of the um, OTI arc. When we start the project, we make sure that we have the correct main voltage and a reasonable overcount protection. Uh, what we also have to do now is tell the system that we want to use the ADC channel and what the resistance of the shunt resistor is. We will include the voltages for completeness. We can actually see that the voltage rail is a different voltage because it's uh, powered by a DC-DC converter. If we turn the power on, we start the recording and we see that um, the device will enter sleep mode. I wake up the radio by pressing a button. we can stop the recording there. If we now go in measuring when it's idle we get both the, the sets of recordings. The main current will show the total energy spent 863 nanowatt hours in this case and 254 of those went into the BLE chip which means that the board peripherals including the DC-DC converter consumed the rest of it. When we move over to where the radio is actually active, we can see that we now have 11.8 microwatt hours total energy over this time period and 7.56 went into the BLE chip, which means that now a more than half of the energy is actually going into the, uh, the chip. This makes it easier to pinpoint the specific device or power rail that uses more energy than expected when compared to the main current. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tutorials. For discussion on energy optimization, please visit our forum at koitech.com. We'd love to hear from you.